Right, skiing is, uh, you're basically considered Sophia to have to be on these planks and put rockets on the back of her skis, all right? And then as you're looking out, consider that mountain to basically drop straight off and she's hitting about 60 miles an hour. To give you the comparison of that is there's about 12 schools that we were up against and every single one of those schools uh, that saw Sophia walking across get ready to go into the house, they all said, watch this. That's who I'm standing next to. So it's my honor to be next to her. And I, I really mean that. Uh, a little more about um, the Flow District, we know that we match up with uh, Rampo, and there's six athletes over at Po that looked up to her. So I want you also to understand that there's a couple of sophomores and a couple of juniors that literally she took on effectively under her wing, taught them different angles and certain techniques, uh, passion, and how to take it down this mountain to make sure that she won. Now every race is important to understand also that we weren't able to meld our two schools to be a co-op, right? The New Jersey Ski Association was scared, and I'm telling you that they were scared because had she been a part of the Ramapo Indian Hills um, co-op team, bar none, we would have been champions. Don't even question it, it's done by the times. It's an individual sport, but as a team and as a co-op, would have been done. They literally didn't let us join, and um, it's a testament to her dedication, right? From injury to health, wellness, and then drive. So I couldn't be more proud. I'm extremely happy to be a part of, uh, of your athleticism, and I congratulate you for moving on to your next chapter of life. And uh, congratulations on the graduation. Thank you all. Have a great night. Thanks, Billy. I would like to do a voice call. So, voice call.